This weather video is brought to us by 802cars.com, representing 802 Toyota, Twin City, Subaru, and 802 Honda, all located off of Exit 7 on I-89. Looking at uh, an impulse uh, and leftovers of a decaying uh, mesoscale convective system, this is a blob of thunderstorms or a cluster of thunderstorms. It still has some active thunderstorms feeding off better instability across portions of uh, really uh, south and west of the Albany, uh, Schenectady area, the capital district. And uh, just a few of these are in decay and moving across portions of Vermont. So far out of this entire blob, uh, it's this uh, slight bow echo here, uh, just a little bit south of the Albany area, that shows uh, any promise of any severe weather. Uh, 26 knots of shear and uh, producing about uh, four flashes per minute uh, for lightning in this particular area. And taking a look at that, this is uh, the lightning strikes. So you can see that it's tracked down a little bit uh, north of the Mohawk Valley from uh, parts of uh, eastern Lake Ontario, the Watertown area. There was a warning out earlier on, but this is passing south of Vermont. There could be one or two lightning strikes here in southwestern uh, Bennington County, Pownell. Uh, that's going to be about it. This is uh, slowly dying out and looks like things are setting up for uh, the back end, a little bit of sunshine and Perhaps some more instability to form some showers and thunderstorms in these locations here in parts of southern New York, but uh, not so much in Vermont. And latest radar out of Burlington shows that the back edge of a few showers rolling through uh, parts of central and northern Vermont, really fairly light, and uh, a lot of this is beginning to wind down a little further off to the west of us. Looking at the Albany radar, this is that uh, feature here. could be... A little bit of a Boeing echo feature, but uh, looks like there's no warnings out on it, and uh, Doppler does not look like it's uh, showing up with anything significant at this point in time. But uh, this feature here, you can see Boeing down the uh, Mohawk Valley, and uh, looks like it's going to miss Vermont and just the uh, shield of clouds and the uh, sort of northern portion of the cumulonimbus uh, mass just kind of dragging across parts of southern Vermont. Have really no issues uh, expecting today. Um, looks like the rest of today is actually things are going to wind down for a little bit of a break in the action until the cold front moves in later on tonight. Roger Hill, Weathering Heights.